Hi, I'm Dr. Brian Orr. Last year, in February of 2017, I attended the America's Committee for the Treatment of and Research of Multiple Sclerosis, and I saw a very interesting presentation there. Um, it was actually a pilot study on the use of a pharmaceutical grade probiotic uh, originally intended to treat an autoimmune disease of the gut called inflammatory bowel disease. But in this study, they're using that probiotic to treat a different autoimmune disease called multiple sclerosis, which affects the nervous system. And there are very interesting results. So I was anxiously awaiting the publication of the study, which happened just last month in January of 2018. And uh, the results were quite interesting. Uh, what they found was that the probiotic, after about two months of use, uh, induced the immune system in these MS patients to become much less inflammatory, much less aggressive, much more tolerant, and much more peacekeeping. And specifically what they saw were uh, fewer uh, inflammatory cells called monocytes, as well as fewer cells that help drive the autoimmune process that are called dendritic cells. Uh, so, as many of my patients know, I am an advocate of using probiotics to treat autoimmune disease, and I usually start with the probiotic that was actually used in the study, specifically because it is a pharmaceutical grade probiotic used and designed to treat an autoimmune disease, inflammatory bowel disease in this case. But we now have a study showing that it can be used to treat autoimmune diseases outside of the gut, like multiple sclerosis, which affects the nervous system. So uh, first study of its kind, very exciting results. And if you have an autoimmune disease, I highly recommend that you talk with your doctor and find a good probiotic to get you started.